All right, hello everyone, and welcome to my new Fallout 4 mini series of Age of Airships 2, where today I am so excited to be starting this one up as we had a lot of fun with the original Age of Airships mod that we looked at quite a long time ago. Now, it was a pretty cool thing, all the fun airships to explore, but it was mainly about exploring those airships. There wasn't a whole lot of questing to be done in it. It was just awesome, amazing dirigibles, and I loved it. Now, this new Age of Airships 2 is far more about the questing aspect, adding in a whole new open world area for us to explore, as well as a number of quests apparently involving time travel. So I am very intrigued to get this whole thing started up and can't wait to see what all we do encounter. And I am still hoping we get to explore some fun airships because, I mean, it is called Age of Airships, and I did really like exploring those in the original one. So let's go into the Pit Boy. When you do start this quest up and install it into your game, you're going to get this Back to the Past mission, where we need to investigate the abandoned warehouse near Diamond City. So I've brought us just to the entrance to Diamond City, and this warehouse is just off this main square. So let's uh, jump straight in and get things going. Granted, it says abandoned house here rather than warehouse, but okay, okay, in we go. All right, and we um are in an empty room with an odd glow coming from downstairs. Cool, anything? Nope, nothing to loot. Did you make a plane poster? Okay, I, t <laughs> I, s I saw the pop up here and then that in my corner of my vision. Okay, is this a portal? I wonder what may be on the other side. Should I go in? Well, of course we're going to go in. Of course we are going to go in, but holy crap! I mean, I really should have expected something like this, considering the mod does say on its page that it involves time travel. So I guess there would need to be some sort of teleport thing, but I wasn't expecting a Stargate-esque thing. Neat. All right, let's go take a look at the Pip-Boy. What do we got here? Investigate what's on the other side. Wonderful. Also, why is, does this room appear to have exploded? I don't think that bodes well for my survival through this portal. Also, that looks familiar. Hmm. Cool. Alright, well, through, you know what? Keep the gun out just in case. Dr. Sternberg's house. Okay, you know what? I don't think I need the gun. I don't think I need the gun. We're going to some guy's house. We may still need the gun, but we can always pull it out later. All right, <laughs> through the portal to Dr. Sternberg's house. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, I wonder what we're gonna find. Ooh. Oh my, a very nice, clean home. Interesting. Oh yeah, we can go back to the abandoned house through there. Nice, okay, all right. Well, let's follow the waypoint and head outside the house to New Belfast. Okay. I am even more intrigued. I'm guessing this is that hub, uh, new open world area that we get with this. I'm guessing we just got teleported into here for our adventuring to begin. So I'm intrigued exactly where we are and what we're going to encounter. Hmm. Hmm. This also seems to be a very long loading screen. Not the longest we've ever had, but I'll bring you guys back in a second when we actually do get to loading in, because I have a feeling this one's going to take a while. Ah, uh, so we've loaded in, and there are cars driving around, somewhat wonkily driving around, but there are cars, there's an airship in the sky, oh my god, oh hello, this, this is the past, I, I can't believe it, this is incredible, wait, this changes everything. If I use this device to go back to the past, I can go back to the future! My future! I can save my family. I can save the world from the bombs! I have to find the man behind all this. Perhaps in that house, I can find some clues as to where he is. Oh, so I have to go back in the house with the long loading screen. I'm gonna not. <clears throat> okay. Rescuing the savior, search the house for clues. Oh my god, we're, yeah, so we're in the old world. Neat. I like it. 
All right, all right, all right. So back inside, I guess. Oh, whoa, we actually have a map. <gasps> I, I went in here because I was curious because a lot of quest and adventure mods don't include a map. This one does. Oh, looks like we got an airfield over there. Maybe a harbor there. Something. Suburbia, perhaps. No, nah, looks too big. It's probably like a mansion out there. Someone's a state. Intriguing. All right, so rescuing the savior. <sighs> yeah, we got to go back in the house. Hopefully, maybe, since, you know, we were literally just there, the loading screen won't be so long because, holy crap, that took like two minutes. Oh, thank God we're in. All right, we got one thing there. Oh, what about this? No, nothing on the desk. We can steal the car Liesel typewriter. No, 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 no. Let's do search the books and journals. I pursued through, or perused, my god, perused through the books on the shelf and found a journal of Dr. Sternberg. Oh man, we're going through their journal now, that's just rude. He found the tomb in Rub al Kali and wrote about it being able to react to electrical devices. Without a plug of any kind of uh, connection, the ring would consume electric power and activate. In later notes, I found his plans for the expedition. He plans to travel south. Oh, shit, is he insane? Those marshes are dangerous. He's the only man who can make this device work. I must make sure to find him before mutants eat him. Mutants? Wait, what? Mutants are... We're, we're in the past here. I hope I'm not too late. There there shouldn't be mutants. We're, we're in the past. But okay, we're going to go save Dr. Sternberg. I'm going to steal his stuff, though, first. <laughs> I mean, yeah... <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, so wait. Oh, oh, he's going back to the... Oh, the marshes in our world. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, man, but I want to explore this new one. Can I activate any of these things? No. <sighs> All right, let's follow the quest. Let's follow the quest right now. Let's go back to the abandoned house, back to the Commonwealth. And go save the perfect. Oh, I wanted to go outside! <sighs> no, 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 no. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go save this dude. I'm sure it'll take us back there shortly, quickly, because that was clearly a whole world to explore. So there's going to be a lot of things happening there, I would assume. But let's save the doctor, and perhaps he can help us explore that strange past. And hopefully he's not dead. If we have to figure out some time teleporting weird ring thing. Oh, God, we're hmm, probably going to be in trouble doing it on our own. But oh well, oh well. To the marsh. See, I was confused when it said there were mutants in the marsh. I figured that meant this world, because there was in that southern portion of the map, that large empty area that I thought, oh, maybe there's a marsh down there. But no, no, they meant back in our world, back in our, well, time, I guess. Our time. Also, my god, we're back to long loading sky. I guess because we did move from one fully loaded area to the next, but all right, where are we heading? Where are we heading? Uh, okay, Summit County Charter School is the closest thing I've got. We'll teleport there and then head south and save our new doctor friend. At least I'm hoping he'll be our friend. He may not help us, who knows? Granted, he definitely shouldn't help us change the timeline, because that's that's never a good plan. Never change the timeline. You're just going to mess it up. That is what every piece of time travel media has always told you. Don't mess with the past. <laughs> Alright, okay. I'm not going to bother with anything here. Let's just keep traveling south. Gun out! Alright. Let's go find ourselves a doctor. Uh yeah, I'm hearing gunfire. That's not good. Seems to be in that direction, though. Not quite where I'm heading. And... God, just deep into the marsh. Oh, we got grenades! Never mind, it is by us! It is by us! Rotting feral ghoul char... Oh, you know what? He actually seems to be handling himself pretty well over here. Damn it, I knew it! Sternberg is in danger! I gotta do something fast! Well, I mean, that's the plan. Uh, let's... Okay, I really can't hit him there very well. There we go, that one's down. I mean, who was that person? 
Oh, that, uh, that's, okay, that's the bad, okay, it's far away, though, it's far away. Hi, ghoul! All right, there is another person over there shooting, though. Sternberg, did you have a friend? All right, it's not on our map, so it's none of the other things. Hi, Sternberg! Oh, you had a, a private guard with an Italian helmet. I've, I've taken it. Hi, hold on, I'm gonna check back here. There was another dude with a gun. Feral ghoul. Oh, maybe that was that guy and he died there. Hmm, all right. Hey! A human? A real human? Thank you so much for help. I was sure I was going to be eaten alive. This is madness. What is this place? What happened to this world? Monsters. Monsters everywhere. Are, are those people we just killed? Also, you haven't seen people yet. Your abandoned house with the portal was literally next to Diamond City. All right. There's no time to explain, though, apparently. Are you Dr. Sternberg? Yes, I am. You have no idea how grateful I am for your help. I was a fool, a fool, I tell you, to venture recklessly through the ring. Ah, uh, but what would you know of it? Are you a native to this uh, land? Yes and no, Doctor. I'm... Well, it's very complicated. There's There was freezing involved. It's, it's a story. What matters is that we need to get back into your time. Time? The ring. So it's true. It... Did took me through time, but this place doesn't make sense. Has there been a war? Oh, 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 yeah. Hmm, what do we got here? I beg of you, we will have the, all the time in the world to talk. Are you, you are the only one able to stop this? I need to get out. No, I think I like this one. There was a war, uh, a third world war. We unleashed a weapon you can't even comprehend. You see the results. Now we have to go back into the past. Third? So there were more than the Great War? Yes! Okay, so yeah, your world... I guess that would make sense with the airships and the cars outside. You are pre-World War II. All right. I have so many questions, but you're right. They have to wait. I escort the doctor to his house in the past. I should talk to him there. Hi. No, we just... Okay, so we're literally just teleporting straight back to his house. Oh, thank God. I don't have to busy myself going around. Hi, Dr. Sternberg. I really wish you were voice acted, though, but oh well. Let's talk. Good to be safely home. Now, you have my deepest thanks. Good sir, I am a madam, I'll have you know. I have so many questions. Can you please explain what was back there and what happened and when? What you saw was the year 2277. I personally came from 2077. You proceed to explain your story and the story of the world. What have they done? I'm... So sorry about your family, your son, eh. I thought when I came back from the trenches in France it would be the last time I saw such a thing happen. But people just can't stop. Yep, war never changes, my friend. I understand your motivation. You possess a great gift to the world. You know what will happen. You know what to do. Doctor, it won't matter if I can't go to a specific place in time. Please, can you set the machine for October 20th? I'm pretty sure you're gonna need more time than that. I must save my family. Yeah, and not stop the bombs? I mean, uh, alright, fine. I mean, who's gonna believe a time-traveling weirdo, though? I'm afraid this device doesn't have any setups. I cannot set any date or place. I just barely began to properly study it. Maybe if I... Doctor, this is very, very important. Maybe the most important thing in the world. What do you need? Ah. <sighs> It's more complicated than that. Well, firstly, we need a better lab. More equipment, resources to build any devices we require, and specialists to operate them. We'll need a fortune, and we don't have that kind of wealth. Apparently, yes, we do. We have the future. Doctor, get hold of black marketers, art dealers, antique traders, and the like. I'm going back to the future. Play theme music. <laughs> I have a plan. Art. Real, genuine pieces. They litter every museum in Boston. In the future, they just gather dust. Not worth more than crap. Here, they are priceless. If I get a, a rally important piece <laughs> uh, and bring it to the past, I'll pass myself as an art thief. Those black marketeers won't be any wiser. They'll get genuine pieces. I'll just lie. I replaced originals with fakes. And I'll be able to raise the needed funds. Everybody's happy. It, oh. Yeah, sure, everybody's happy. Except for the fact that all that art has greatly degraded over, like, the hundreds of years since this point, and would need full restorations, uh, you know, before anyone believed it. 
All right, we're gonna click okay though. Hey. Yeah. All right, apparently I'm going back to our world of steel art. <laughs> Time smuggler, oh my God, that is the, I, I, I want, I want an entire series of things just called Time Smuggler. <laughs> Steal a famous portrait from the museum in Concord. Got it. Back to the old world. Or the new world, rather. Yes, that is definitely true. Oh, thank God. It's loading much quicker now that we keep going back and forth between the places. But sadly, we must go to Concord. Can I fast travel from in here? I'm guessing no, because inside it also thinks I'm still down there. Cool. <laughs> to Museum of Freedom. Oh, yep. Back to the fence. I really like the name Time Smuggler. <laughs> I don't just want a whole series in Fallout 4 for that. I want a game called Time Smuggler. <laughs> Oh, uh, we could be like the doctor, but a thief. I mean, he also kind of is a thief on occasion, but like a proper thief. <laughs> oh my god, I want that to happen. I want that to be a thing. Please, someone in the comments, tell me if that actually does exist somewhere. <laughs> I want to know. Oh my god, it's going to take a while to load now, isn't it? Oh, but we just were here. All right, you know what? I'll bring you guys back in once I'm actually at the Museum of Freedom. I think that'll be a better way to go about it so you don't have to sit through this loading screen and the next. See you in a sec! What's that? And we're back in the Museum of Freedom, and apparently it's been so long since I've been here that raiders have respawned into the world. Nothing Fun! All right, well, we get to kill all of them again. There were also raiders outside, which was very annoying. What's I always that? hate when you uh, fast travel into a new area and you're surrounded. It's, I mean, they all died super easy, but still. But still. It's annoying. Well, all right, let's kill all these fools. Yeah, she was right. And hi! Oh, missed ya. There we go. <laughs> One shot on you guys. You're all very low level raiders. Okay, okay. Who else needs to die? Oh, there we are. Oh, look at how little damage they're doing to me. I feel sorry for them. Not really, though. They're raiders still. Oh, hi! Oh, God! How dare you hit me with a pull cue? That's just rude. I'm just here to steal art. Why are you fighting me? <laughs> All right, we're, we're still going upstairs, huh? Where's the up? Was it back here? God, it's been so long since I've been in here. I don't remember the layout of this place. Okay, I remember us going around this way and die. Wow, I shot either side of you. Jesus. <laughs> okay, let's get ourselves some precious art. And then back. To the future. Or, well, no, past, past. We're in the future now. Get, get it right, get it right. Yeah, that would definitely need some restoration before anyone believed it. I managed to take the portrait from Concord Museum. This one looks nice enough. Original work. It should commend a neat price on the black market. It'll probably avoid being destroyed this way. All right, cool. So back we go. I mean, I actually don't seem to have a waypoint out, but... Hmm. I assume we go back and talk to the guy. Let's see if once we get outside, if something happens. But yeah. I wonder if we're just going to steal this one, or if it's going to send us on a couple of these things. Interesting. Interesting thought. Let's actually take a look at the Pip-Boy, though, real quick, because I definitely don't have a thing. Yeah, talk to him about the Black Marketeer. Just still find that amusing that we're getting into the black market now. <laughs> hey, hey! Why does the waypoint still say here? All right, I think the waypoints might be a little borked. All right, back to Diamond City. <laughs> All right, uh, God, that takes us inside, doesn't it? Penn Street sewer, park view, park view apartments. Yeah, I'll do it. That's around the corner, isn't it? Ah, it'll be fine. Because, yeah, if we hit the Diamond City one, that takes us inside to, like, that entrance. And we'll still have to do another loading screen to get back out into the fens. This, at least, will take us out into the fens. We may have some super mutants to deal with, but overall, there, there's super mutants. It's not a problem in the slightest. So, yeah, let's uh, do that and head back to talk with the good doctor, who apparently has or is going to try and find some black market contacts. I don't know about you, but... I don't have. Who has black market contacts? 
Oh, I mean... I wonder how hard that really would be to find. Well, these days, not so much. You got all that stuff online. But back then? World War One time era? Where am I? Oh, God, we're over here? Oh, I'll super mutant shot at you! Maybe it would have been quicker to go to the other area. Oh, God, around, I think? Now oh, I kind of think I could have maybe gone through this way. Yep, yep. Through, there we go. Oh, I! Super suicider! I get a mini nuke. Die, you. I don't care! You guys could just leave me alone and I'll walk through, but no! There we go. I'm gonna ignore the rest of you. I have a mission. Where am I going? Where am I going? I'm entirely lost now. <laughs> okay, we're heading the right way this direction. <laughs> I don't spend a lot of time in this part of the world. I mean, there's not usually a huge amount of quests around here. Or at least in the, like, quest and adventure mods we play. I've gone weird, haven't I? Other side of this, other side of this, other side of this. Oh my god, yep, yep, this is this is why I wish I had the quest marker right now. Or, you know, I could just remember things. <laughs> there we go, here we are. Beautiful, and Rad Roach, stop it! How rude. Okay, so back to the past. Reload. And let's see what we're going to be dealing with here. Perfect. Yeah, hopefully he found us some uh, nice black market contacts. That'll be good. Let's put the new fancy future gun away so we don't blow their mind. Uh, all right. Dr. Sternberg, you better have found a guy. Hi! You have the artwork! Incredible! So much time and it barely a No, it definitely would have a lot. Yeah, I got you a contact, Connor. He got his, he's got his den, Marksfield Street 4, the basement. Be careful, he may be the best of the best in his class, but he's cranky and well-armed. Huh? I think I can beat him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yes, we're going out into the world now. Yes, into New Belfast to talk to a black market guy. Awesome. Oh, we get to explore it now. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm excited. But this the screen's gonna take a while again. It took like two minutes to load last time. Alright, yeah, I'll bring you guys back in a minute. <laughs> oh my god, that loading screen takes so long. Another solid two minutes to get in, but alright, we're here. We're here. So let's check our uh, pit boy here real quick. Okay, so we're just on the other side of that big building in the center. And yeah, take the stolen painting to Connor. Excellent! Let's do this. I don't think we're going to blend in very well in this world, though. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on, hold on. We got ourselves a new hat. Italian helmet. Huh? 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 Yeah, no, we still, no. It still looks bad. Also, our hair is gone. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's move. Oh, oh, hello. Well, since I'm back to a time of drivable roads, I guess might as well get a set of wheels? <gasps> There's got to be a car shop somewhere around here. A new quest has been added to your quest list. <gasps> we get to drive cars. Oh, great. I can run into people in this one like I do in Cyberpunk. Cool. <clears throat> oh, I assume I'll be here for a while, so I might as well search for a house to buy. <gasps> A quest is- oh my god, we can buy a house? Cool. I might want to look into some location of note. This isn't a nuclear wasteland, and I can't just walk into any place like so. Alright, we gotta get some threads. Okay, oh my god, yes. Okay, over to data, over to data. Alright, your own set of wheels. Go to Galergeru and Seth Automobile Shop. Home sweet home. Find Desmond's Real Estate Shop. And location of note. Oh, okay, so finding places. Well, let's, uh, let's turn this off. Let's go do this one first. Yeah, there we go. Find those different locales. Pharmacy, enter, clothes store, gun store, Karamazov pub, grocer, jewelry store. Oh my god, there's a lot of places. McDo diner. <laughs> Harry's gun shop. Oh, all right, nice, 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 nice. Neat. Oh, 
Oh, we got a lot of places around here. All right, let's do the ones right around here. Hi, I'm back in first you? person right now. Okay, we've got the barber shop. <gasps> barber shop. <laughs> oh my god, yes. We have a whole new open world and things. Oh, I gotta figure out if I'm gonna assume caps still work here. Uh, but huh? hi, barber. Yeah. Apparently, wants me to sit. I can't. I cannot sit. Nor interact with this. Yeah. Barber. Hey. Yes. Nope. <laughs> oh, it sounds like cars going by outside. That's cool. That's actually quite neat. Uh, yeah. yeah, I can't actually appear to do anything in here. Well, that's unfortunate. I could apparently steal all their stuff, though. <gasps> yes. Can I talk to any of you? Oh, oh, hi. Uh, who are you? Just a regular, honest worker. I barely have enough to go on. I still got kids to feed. I don't know what's worse, that I spend my last pennies to drown my sorrows in booze, or that I can't even buy it. Oh, any rumors going around? Them Silver Legion freaks are nice and dandy on the street, but don't ever get into a shady corner or a locked space with those guys. These no- oh! Okay, so, oh right. They'll just kill you for not having a proper nose shape, and I tell ya, commies are different. They at least welcome people. But you do something stupid, they won't forget nor forgive. Alright, you know what? I was kind of intrigued about the Silver Legion lounge that I saw, but now I want to blow it up. <laughs> Uh, in, you know what, uh, you know, uh, what's your thoughts on what current situation? I don't know, but current situation? It's all gone to shit in 1928. The crash on Wall Street didn't just make it rain people in New York. It literally ruined everything. I'm lucky to even have a job. Most of my friends went begging or simply left town. You know, Bolsheviks at least have ideas to solve our problems. Not like our government that put us in bigger debts. And all this chaos just to make those racist silver legionnaires and KKK get even more support. It's power to the workers. Ain't no matter if they're black. Alright, I like this guy. I like this guy. He knows what's up. Where can I get special jobs? Charisma 5. Do I have Charisma 5? I don't know. Let's find out. Shh, not so loud. If you need some non-standard jobs, I hear you can visit a guy called Brombones. He offers hazard jobs, if you know what I mean. Personally, don't have the balls for it. I don't want to deal with the boomers. But you look like somebody up for it. He's in a joint somewhere between the rich district and the airport city boundary. Oh, nice. Is there entertainment I can get around here? <clears throat> yes. Uh, apparently not. He just stops talking. All right. Uh, chat with the worker to raise affection? Okay. Blank. <laughs> All right. Well, yes. bye, worker. Hi. Other resident? Yes. Nope, nothing. <clears throat> Other worker? Huh? Oh, my God. Could we start a worker's revolution? Down with the proletariat. <laughs> Hi. Huh? Okay, apparently that's the only thing I can do. I have a feeling something's broken here, unfortunately. But all right, out we go. Let's go find a clothing store. <gasps> I can get some threads. Oh my god, we need to go find a clothing store. Clothing store. Okay, okay, okay. Did that actually give me? No, we actually don't have like a waypoint for that. There are definitely some waypoints on the mini map here. Why well, was what a cave? I kind of want to see what's in the cave. Uh oh. Oh, that's one of those back alley deals the guy told us about, huh? Oh, yes. look at all this! They got all sorts of people! Oh, those look like the... It uh, looks like the... Oh god, what was a yeah. slang term for cops back in those days? I don't know. Yes. I was about to say fuzz, but no, that's like 60s, 70s. Bobby's English? What would they have called him here? I don't know. Also the... Oh god, car! You know what? Can I actually get hit by a car? Let's find out. Nope. <laughs> All right, we got that. We got that uh, cave one. I don't know. Oh, Jesus, the cart just terrified me there. Don't know what that is, but all right, let's move this way. All right, I want to find a clothing store. We need to get some threads. My armor is wonderful and all, but... All right, refreshments. We've got public occurrences. So that's Jackstown's fineries. Oh, we got Fallons. Oh, we got Fallons. We could probably find clothes in there. I wonder what the finery store, though, is. Let's find out. Okay, yeah, we're going to spend a few more minutes exploring this world. I need to know things and find clothing. Oh, <gasps> clothing. I mean, I can just steal it, but let's talk to the dude. Yes? Oh, rich tycoon! Hey. Yeah? No, he won't talk. Yes? Rich lady? Hey there. Nope. Yes. 
Hey, Scava. Let's trade. Hi. Uh, so what's new? Hear anything lately? Not really. Let's get back to talking about all these great items I have for sale. You got it, Barter. Let's see what you have. Oh my god, oh my god. <gasps> Black trench cap. Oh, cool. Actually, it's actually got some pretty decent damage resistances, too. Maybe we buy it. Maybe we buy it. And yeah, of course, we're using caps. So black vest and that. Oh, we got a bowler hat. Chef's hat, of course. Like the bowler hat, though. Uh, crumpled fedora. You know what? Since we're, you know what? We're going to get into the spirit of things with this. Let's entirely change our armor out. Which does mean, though... I'm gonna have to sell my armor because it's so heavy it will make me over encumbered without the pockets that it holds. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it though. Let's get ourselves. Oh, nice trilby. One charisma. Worn fedora. Uh, some luck might be good. Let's definitely get the black trench coat because, yes, actually has some protection. That's good. Uh, none of the hats in here had any protection. You know, let's go with, uh, the nice... Well... You know, a nice bowler hat. There was one of those in here. Ooh, a luxury dress. Ooh, hello. Where's the bowler hat? Triggerman bowler! I'm like, what was the other bowler? It was up this way. Uh, am I blind as a bat? Nope, there it is. Ah, endurance! Oh, yeah, we'll take that one instead, definitely. All right, so 320 caps, and you know what I'm going to do? We're just going to sell our armor. This is probably going to be a horrible mistake, but... Also, the guy has no money. He actually literally can't pay me. Never mind! All right, well, let's see how over-encumbered I get. <laughs> oh, God, I'm at 332 right now. Oh, no. Bowler hat. Nice. Oh, hey, I'm not over-encumbered. Nice! Oh, wait. I like it. I like it. We literally probably could have stolen this exact getup. Let's actually take a look. Huh? Oh, there's the black vest. Oh, we got those hats. You know, I'm happy. Oh, yeah, black trench coat. There it is. Could have stolen it. Could have stolen it. Oh, well. Now we look the part. <laughs> there are also some, like, uh, period guns in this, too. So I think I should probably off camera what I'll do, in fact is I'll go back... Travel Company? Oh, cool. Huh? I'll probably what? go back to uh, the future and um, drop all my stuff off and buy some guns here. Let's actually try and find the huh? gun store, huh? though. Can I on the map do, 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 do say the things? Silver Legion, Doe, Jewelry Store. Oh, God, there were a lot of stuff down here. Did I? No, I went to both of those. Gun Store. Over there. Back that way. Also, what's this? Door inaccessible. Never mind. Yeah, so let's let's definitely do that. We'll we'll, we'll get all period up in here. Do a period yeah. piece. It'll be what magnificent. We got our trench coat. We got our bowler hat. Now we're just gonna get a huh? gun. I mean, honestly, our um. Oh man, what's the gun? I can't, I always forget the name. It's been so. That makes it not too long since we used it. That one would actually fit the period. Spray and pray! There it is. That would, would fit the period, certainly. Maybe we'll keep that one on. <laughs> Let's check out this gun store, though. <laughs> Let's see what they got. Let's see what sort of period guns they've got in here. Oh, hi, sir! I buy and sell. I was hoping to see some of them out here so we could check. Oh, hello. Eh, pretty standard things. Hi, Hi, store clerk. I buy and sell. Mm -hmm. Just put up everything you've got and let's see if we can make a deal. Got it. Barter. Sure. Let's take a look. Love the hat. I need to get some glass. Oh, he only has bullets? Oh. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, man. God, oh, man. Come on. <laughs> I wanted a gun. I wanted one of the period guns. Okay, okay, okay. Back to the map. Back to the map. Jewelry store, McDo Diner, pub over there, Silver Legion Lounge. Anything else out here in the world? We got something down here. Harry's Gun Shop. That's way out there, though. You know, we'll need a car for that. 
you know, since we're not really getting anything for going into these places, I'm thinking it's just showing us where those are. I'm actually going to go. Let's look for the set of wheels. Where's that? Just around the corner. Perfect. That way. All right. I think we showed that we needed to, like, go around here a bit. Oh, it looks like there's a baseball stadium over there. So, yeah, we'll check out the car, and then I think that'll probably be it for today. Huh? I'll go back to the to the future, sell all my crap, or at least pop it somewhere, and only... Oh, God, those teleported in. And only grab weaponry that would fit the time period. So, we'll definitely keep spray and pray, because, yay. Uh, but, yeah, we'll grab some other things. All right, let's go get this. Yeah? We got the automobile store. Yes! In we go! <laughs> Uh, and yeah, and the next time we'll actually go talk to the Black Marketeer. I think that'll be a good one. Oh, look at them all. Oh, I want this one. Oh my god, I can actually... Let's quick save real quick. Oh, it's not letting me get in. I was, I was wondering if I could drive around in the store. <laughs> oh, it is showing them all what it is. Oh my god, look at this beauty. The wedding special. <laughs> Corvega, Apollon. Oh man, there's some nice ones in here. Nice cars. Holy crap. Ooh. I do like that the windows actually still show the outside world. At least cars driving around. That's pretty neat. Oh, Model B, Phaeton. I have an ambulance. Shimmy Deluxe. A Fiat. <laughs> Mitsubishi. I kind of like this one. Let's try and see what the cost is for a Corvega Apollon. Hey. Hi. Grandma, let's trade. Indeed, let's do that. Barter. Let's see what you have. We can buy a BMW. I have the money. <laughs> all right. What was the one I liked though? From the look of it in here, the Corvega. Are they all? Oh no, some of them are actually quite cheap. The ambulance is only seven seventy six. Wow. Yeah, the Model B Phaeton wasn't bad. That's also pretty cheap, too. But you know what? I got caps. I got caps. Wow, they really do run the gamut in here, price-wise. Yeah, no, let's buy that, that nice one. I got the cash. I got the cash. Yeah. Do it. How do I use it? Let's go outside. Also, is that the other dude here? I yep. buy and sell. Just put up everything you've got, and let's see if we can make a deal. Never! Yep, you're just gonna have the same things. I'm out! Let's go out the other side door. Yeah, they really did nice building the interiors of these places. And let's go drive a car! <laughs> and then that's where we'll end for today! Actually, you know, you know what, you know what? Now that we do have a car, let's go out to that other gun store. Maybe they do have the guns I'm hoping for. Where do we gotta go for that? So we gotta go around, out of town, and that way. It was like over here. All right, good, 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 good. Okay, okay, how do I put a car down? <laughs> I'm assuming, you know what, before we do this, we should probably save, just in case it breaks. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'm guessing it's in miscellaneous? Oh, I saw the Corvette and I thought maybe, but no, 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 no. Oh, maybe it's in aid. Sometimes with de deployables, it puts it in aid. Nope. Uh, where do I find car? Is it a weapon? Oh my god, it's a weapon! <laughs> oh, it's a grenade we pop. Okay, okay. Did I just get ripped off? Oh, wait, no, it spawned next to me. Ride! Oh, we can store items in it. Nice. Alright, let's see how this thing drives. I'm excited for this. Yes! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, we're in the car! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Out of my way, people! Oh, I also just realized there are no people in these cars driving around. Not so noticeable in the ones that don't have, or that have roofs on them, but uh, the ones that are... You know, convertibles, very noticeable. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Oh, it's... Oh wait, nope, that's not the way out. How do I get... Hold on. I made a wrong turn. 
All right, back this way, back over here. Pardon me, people. Yeah, yeah, there it is, center thing. All right, we're out. Oh, and look at that uh, that airship going in the distance. It's beautiful. Excuse me, other car I'm phasing through. Don't mind me. Let's just hit up this other gun shop. Boy, I wish this thing was faster. I wonder if one of the cars over there is much fat. Oh, the racing one. I should have bought the racing one. Oh, man, I want in there, though. Uh, I think it was this way. Oh, we actually can also do uh, look and drive. Okay, so we're gonna, we can use the Waz keys, but also look and drive. That one's much smoother, less jarring. All right, where's this gun store? Oh, we got more people here, cops doing things. Uh, I think we're almost there. Yeah, it's it's just in here somewhere. Oh, no, I keep hitting escape. Where's this gun store? Wow, a lot of people out here. Uh, we got a Shamrock Tap House. Nice. Oh, shit. Whoa! Communist. Wait, 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 why are those people? Communist protester, commissar. Why are they angry at me? Oh, God, don't go. Oh, I've been shot at. How did. Okay, they have to die now. How do I get out? How do I get out? Nah, there we go. I hit E. I'm staring at the sky now. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, who gets to die? Also, can I reclaim my car? Oh, it came with a robot repair kit. I don't think I can reclaim it. Oh, wait, wait, no, we've, we've played mods like this before. You punch it. Yes, there we go, there we go. All right. Who are the communist propaganda? Oh, boomer gang. Okay, so everyone's angry at me. Okay, we got communist protesters who are angry and boomers. How dare you? Oh man, you're actually kind of tough. Well, you're dead now. Soviet stash key! Oh, nice. I also wonder, can I steal a car? Nope. <laughs> Worth a try. Worth a try. Alright, where's the... where's the... Alright, yeah, you die. Well, hold on, there's someone sitting in the street there. You die first. Wow, yeah, these guys are tough. Oh, wait. Legendary enemy is mutated. How dare they mutate in the past? They're not great with their pathing right now. Now he mutated again, that's unfortunate. The ones with the guns that- uh, Oh, Stan! Oh no, Stan! Why Stan? And Hugh! Why are you making me do this to you? And we got the gangsters now. That's right, you run! A board. Oh, you. Okay, you- Oh god, they're all legendaries! Bandage, nascent iodine. Another Soviet stash key I don't need. Ow, ow, who's shooting? Oh my god! Last mis oh. Shady guy! Boomer gangster and more shady guys! Oh my god, we have really walked into the crap here. Die, Commissar! Okay, he's dead. Wounding harpoon gun, communist orders, gotta take that. Nice nine done. Cherry shake, yeah, definitely. Mariner hat, some mariner <laughs> uniform. All right, at least these guys are. How dare you? How dare you, shady guy? All right, all right, all right, all right. They're dead. This guy around here, he ran around the car. How dare you, boomer gangster? Got him. All right, where's another guy over here? Wow, we really, we really walked into some crap here. And everyone seems to want us dead, no matter what faction or gang they're from. <laughs> All right, that everyone? Okay, we're good. Let's look around. Oh, that's a weapon over there I can use. Heavy Lapura. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, yes! Ew. I'll take that money, though. Uh, Quick draw walking cane. Okay. Walter PPK. Oh god, he's another one of those. Uh there we go. <laughs> Alright, we actually did get ourselves some uh old school weaponry here. Oh, I'm pretty happy about that. And some bandages and iodine too. A, a straight up Tommy gun. I'm cherry shake. Uh you had uh, another heavy lapura. Take that. Cult Detective Special, sure. Oh, I'm over encumbered now, awesome. Of course, of course. 
All right, where's the gun shop here? Where is that? Okay, let's turn on that thing. We've killed everyone. We've done the things. There we go. Ah, there it is. Oh, yes, next to that. Why is the pit boy here? <laughs> Harry's. Wow, yeah, things really kicked off there, huh? But yeah, we got some guns, though. Let's see what else they got in here, though. Hopefully some good ones. Hi, resident! Hi, how are you? Oh, this guy looks like he's got- he sells shady weaponry. I like it, I like it. Let's chat. Let's hey, chat, scabber. sir! Let's trade. Indeed, Harry. Let's see what you got. Alright, he's got a lot more. We, gotta, we already have one of those now. We have one of those. We have- And we're back after not one, but in fact, three crashes. Now, don't worry. Yeah. Two of those crashes were actually me testing something. I looked back at the video footage after the first test to see if there was anything I did specifically that caused it to crash, and then I wanted to test that to be sure. And that's why we crashed two more times after that first initial one. It appears that Harry has a weapon in his shop inventory that will immediately crash the game if I take a look at it, and that is the Kit Basher. Which worries me that there might be some other gun that um, will crash me somewhere. Also, is that a... Oh, yeah, that's a... Oh, God, what's it called? Panzerfaust? I so, yeah, I'm so. a little worried about just that, but uh, let's go back into his inventory and just avoid that gun let's and take a look at got. some of the other things because I am intrigued what else he has. And so far, nothing of value. We've got a frag grenade there, a gas grenade. We already have a heavy lapper and a carabiner. Uh, the Kit Basher, there's the evil one that will crash us. Let's go to the other side. Ooh, yep, yeah, we have a Panzerfaust. <gasps> and a PPSH! You know what? Let's buy one of you. Let's buy one of you. Uh, just one. And let's buy a Springfield. Lovely. There we go. And let's go back over... Oh god, no, I'm gonna have to scroll down a little bit more here. So we got the shotgun shells, uh, style hand granata, so that's, you know, just a German hand grenade there. Uh, let's, I'm kind of worried about that one, so let's go back over here. We got the Thompson, we actually already picked up one of those. Oh, a Tokarev. Oh my god, I don't want to, I'm, I'm so paranoid to hover over any of these weapons just in case it crashes things now. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, I'm gonna buy one of you two just to play around with them. Uh, we already got... Oh, no, we actually have... We have a Tommy gun, but we don't have one of the proper Thompsons that we saw up there. Uh, I may go back and buy one of those, too. Western Revolver. Boring. Boring. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Go back to here. Go back to... Oh, no, there it was. The Thompson M1A1. I mean, it looks exactly the same. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to care too much about that one. Uh, but, well, let's ta just take a look at quick at the stats between that and the Tommy gun that I picked up. This one has more damage from going with this. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, let's buy these weapons. There we go. Lovely. Again, I could have just stolen them from over here. But, you know, hey, 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 let's, let's not be, let's not be that guy. And yeah, I'm, oh, we got some Canadian boxes down there. Lovely. So yeah, I'm happy with that. We've got our new guns. We've got some sweet wheels. And we have made enemies in this world already. Good times. Good times. So yeah, off cam, I'm going to get rid of my future stuff. And then we will just use in-game uh, existing old world weaponry. I'm intrigued to see how that all goes. But that's going to be it for this one, folks. Hopefully you all have enjoyed and yet yeah, do come back for the next. Oh, but until that time, thank you for watching. And as always, have a good one.